Olga Tanilova prepares for another day on the book truck. She's in Cranston today and hopes to have 50 visitors come by and sign out a book. This is part of a new service by the Calgary Public Library. We are very lucky to have support from City of Calgary and uh, uh, to purchase two vehicles. And by the way, two more are coming sometime this year as well uh, to offer service to communities that are very far from the library. So uh, Shaughnessy Library is the southern most uh, branch in, in the city and uh, all these new communities that are quite far from the library. So it's really hard for people to get there, bring kids. So we thought we will bring library to them. The book truck is equipped with almost 1,800 books, a checkout station, internet, and solar panels. They come in, uh, they enter the book truck, they browse the collection, uh, then they come into my station over there. I have a Chromebook with the software, library software there. So uh, they give me the library card, I scan the library card, I scan books, I have a little chat and we are, yeah, that's very straightforward and easy. Uh, yeah, we're here every two weeks. Oh, great. Yeah, the girls would like to be a yeah. part of it, so yeah. Uh, we usually pull over at 10, and the story time starts at 10.30. For Shaylee Janney and her son, it's a one-stop shop to meet their library needs. Uh, this is my second time. So this is a very good activity I feel, you know, which the community has set up. And uh, I stay at Cranston only, so I bring my little one. He's three-year-old, so I bring him for story time and for, you know, exchanging the books. So it's a, yeah, it's a good uh, alternative, you know, instead of going to the public library straight away. While this mobile library has been operating since January, Olga believes it will have a great impact. I, I believe in libraries. I believe that um, libraries have impact on, on people's lives, right? And to bring a library to community um, and allow kids to borrow books. Do, do you know that not everyone can afford to buy a book, right? But I, I strongly believe that every child has to have a book and to read a book. And yeah, so I think the impact is quite significant.